once the world starts to kind of open back up and we and we go to having live events. Yeah. You know, as long as we're still home, as long as we're still kind of isolated and separated and operating in our own silos, you know, it's still going to be a little challenging. We're, and we're still going we're still going to have to rely on like, this type of technology to, to really build and connect. Mm -hmm. uh, but I think that we'll be able to kind of get people to break down those walls as things open up more. And and I think it's starting to happen now. You're starting to see more people come out and, and, and companies are having events and we're looking to start having our own events as well. And I think you're, you're gonna start to see those walls come down. Mm -hmm. Now, from a generational standpoint, you touched on something that was very important. You and I, you know, we're from that era where if I wanted to talk to you, I'll pick up the phone and say, hey man, how are you? I'm not just gonna sit there and text you to death, right? I'm gonna pick up the phone. We did old school three-way calls. It wasn't text messaging. You know, the younger demographic, they're growing up in a totally different way. They're, they're connecting and communicating. Is this, you know, I don't wanna to talk to you. They're, they're lacking the, the, that skill of being able to talk to someone. 